Presenting one of the most fuel efficient car in its class, the 2015 BMW 535i sedan in Alpine White. While it is a luxury 5 series model, it managed to get up to 31 miles per gallon, which means you get all the extravagancy of a luxury model while getting the 3 series gas mileage. As for performance, the 2015 BMW 535i features 300 horsepower under its hood that enable it to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.5 seconds. The model we're looking at right now comes with both the driver assistant package and the premium package. The driver assistant package includes the rear view camera, park distance control, and head up display. The premium package includes the power tailgate, smart keyless access entry, and the satellite radio with one year subscription. And the only other extra feature that you have to pay with this model here is the heated seats. Everything else I mentioned throughout the video will come as standard feature. As for pricing, the standard base model in the US is $55,350. And the model we have here with the optional driver assistant package, premium package, and the heated seats total up to be $60,100. Overall, I'm in agreement with BMW that the 2015 535i sedan is indeed an exploration of beauty. Here's the key fob to the car. On there, starting on top, we have the unlock button, lock button, trunk release, and the panic button in red. On the back, we also have a manual button which we can press to release the manual key. Now let's go ahead and unlock the car and take a closer look at the interior. Again, the one we look at right here comes with the smart keyless access entry. So all you really have to do is leave the key fob in your pocket or purse, stand next to the door, put your hand behind the handle to unlock, and to lock, simply touch right there. Interior comes in black Dakota leather along with dark wood trim. Looks very nice and luxurious. Here's a quick view of the back seat. And to start the engine, all we have to do is push our foot down on the brake and press the start button right here. Now to open the hood, that's going to be a lever located right down here. All I have to do is pull this lever out. This will initially open the hood. And to open the hood fully, there's going to be another lever located right below here. All I have to do is pull this lever towards us and raise the hood. Under the hood, the 2015 535i has a 3.0 liter BMW twin power turbo inline 6 cylinder engine with high precision direct injection. The 6 cylinder engine pushes out 300 horsepower at about 5800 rpm and 300 pound foot of torque at about 1300 rpm. It is a 8 speed Steptronic automatic transmission with sport and manual shift modes and adaptive transmission control. The 535i can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.5 seconds while using the automatic transmission and 5.7 seconds while using the manual transmission. Its top speed is electronically limited to 130 miles per hour. As for fuel economy, the 2015 535i gets 20 miles per gallon in the city, 31 miles per gallon on the highway, and when combined it gets 24 miles per gallon. Gas mileage will vary depending on which driving mode the vehicle is in, Eagle, Sport, or Manual mode. To further enhance gas mileage, there is also the Eagle Start and Stop system. When activated, the Eagle Start and Stop system will shut off the engine when it comes to a complete stop such as red lights or other idle situation, and immediately after you lift your foot off the brake, the engine automatically restarts within milliseconds. And of course, this feature can be turned off at any time. Up front, there's the rain sensing power intermittent windshield wiper. Moving down, we have the iconic chrome BMW double kidney grill. Parking assist are built into the front bumper to notify the driver whenever the vehicle gets close to hitting any objects. For enhanced visibility, there's a xenon adaptive headlight with dynamic auto leveling, corona headlight rings, and LED accent lights. And lastly, both lower fog lights are also LEDs. Moving over to the side, there's the cornering light, chrome side strip, body color side view mirror with integrated LED turn signal, power adjustable feature including power folding, and auto dimming function. 
The 535i sedan comes standard with 18 inch light alloy wheels with 245 45 run flat tires. Run flat tires give you the ability to travel up to another 100 miles even when the tire is punctured by sharp objects such as nails. Behind the wheels, we have four wheels ventilated disc brakes with anti lock braking system, dynamic stability control, start off assistant, brake drying, and brake standby feature. All four wheels are equipped with a tire pressure monitoring system. To the back, there's the LED brake light behind the rear windshield. Moving down, we have the LED tail lamp with LED brake light and LED turn signal light. LED technology offers much quicker illumination, thus giving the driver behind you more time to react. Parking assist and a rear view camera is also built into the rear. Further down, there's the attractive Alpine white rear diffuser that matches the body color and hugs the chrome exhaust tip very nicely. As for the gas tank, just make sure the core is unlocked. To open, simply push in. And to lock, simply push back. As simple as that. And it is recommended by BMW to use premium unleaded gas only. Its maximum gas tank capacity is 18.5 gallon. And here's a complete view of the top. We also have the sunroof. Here's a sunroof with the tilt function on. Sunroof can also be opened fully by sliding it back. And I'll show you what it looked like in just a second. On top, we also have mounted bolts. This allows you to mount roof racks on top to carry extra luggage. Let me go ahead and open it and show you what it looks like. There it is. There's two on each side. So you get a total of four. Comes in handy when you're going to carry extra luggage on top. And here's a view of the sunroof fully open. Now let's take a closer look at the trunk. You can either open the trunk manually by pressing this button down here. There's your rear view camera. Or you can open the trunk by using the keyless access entry. Leave the keys in your pocket. Stand about a foot away from the car. Wave your foot under the car. And voila, open just like that. Now for this to work efficiently, you have to turn off your cell phones or any other devices trunk is very spacious and roomy. We have hooks on both sides as you can see there. Core manual. Your fuse box. You can also fold down both rear seats. And here we have a spot for you to put all your tools. And further on top, if you ever get yourself locked in the trunk, you can simply pull this down to release yourself. And lastly, you can close the trunk either manually or use the power feature right here. The lock button lock the car and close the trunk. And the button on the left hand side close the trunk only. And we're back on the inside. And right in front of us, we have the three spoke leather wrap multi function sports steering wheel. Feels very comfortable and nice. On the left hand side, we have your cruise control, BMW badge in the middle along with the horn, different audio modes control on the right along with volume control, voice command, and Bluetooth phone answering option. And the scroll knob right here is used to select the different radio channel and the different settings that you can choose on the head up display here. You can scroll up and down and press down on it to select. And now if you turn the uh, head up display off, you can do that by simply pressing this button. The whole display will move down to the odometer here. And now you can use the same control to change the channel and setting just like it is on the head up display. Here we have your windshield wiper control. Up to increase and down to decrease intensity control in the middle. And press the button on the end to leave it on automatic. And simply pull it towards us to activate the windshield washer. On the left hand side, we have your left and right turn signal, up for right, down for left, and simply pull it towards us to activate the high beam. 
And the button on the end here is used to control the additional display on the odometer, such as the dates and mileage. And down here we have your tilt and telescopic steering wheel control. You can move the steering wheel up, down, towards you, or away from you. Driver air vent, fog light control, headlamps control, and odometer dimmer. The head up display control again. Press once to turn the head up display on, and press it again to turn the head up display off. We have a small storage compartment here. Driver sun visor with a small credit cord holder and a small piece of mirror with light on top which turn on and off according to the open and closure of the mirror. You can also move this over to the side. Comes in handy when it comes to a sunny day. Hand bore there. And here's your beautiful BMW audio and navigation system display with high resolution screen. Moving down in the middle, we have your hazard light control in red. And right below it, we have the door unlock and lock button surrounded by two air vents. And over here, if you pay close attention, right below your engine start and stop button, we have this small button here. This button is used to activate your eco start and stop system. When the light is on, that means your eco start and stop system is on. When the light's off, meaning it is off, you can also tell it by the uh, display on the odometer here. Here we have your audio control, that's where you insert your CD. On the left hand side, we have a small knob to control the volume by twisting it over to right or left and press down to turn the audio on or off. Right below that, we have your dual AC heat climate control. You can control the temperature by twisting the two knob. Further down, as you can see, the wood trim looks very nice. Two additional cup holder. And right in the middle, we have your 12 volt core charger. We also have a small slot for you to put your key. Rest nicely in there. And here's your gear shift box. To use it, simply push your foot down the brake, press the button on the side, push it up to put the car into reverse, and when you do so, the rear view camera will automatically display on the GPS screen here with guided lines which move as you turn the steering wheel, which is a very nice safety feature. Do the same thing, move it down to put the car into drive. Push it over to the left to put the car into manual standard mode. After that, simply push up or down to change gears. And push P on top to put the car back into park. Over here on top, we have your traction control and the different driving modes. You can put the car into sport, eco, or comfort mode. As you move up to sport mode, you get a lot more power with a slight decrease in gas mileage. And as you move down to Comfort and Eco Pro, you get a lot more gas mileage with a slight decrease in power. Here's your parking assist control. Parking brake. And all the way to your right, we have your iDrive system control. It is multi-directional, you can move it up, down, right, or left, and simply press down to select. You can also twist it over to right or left to zoom in and out on the map. Let's go ahead and show that to you. As you can see, we can zoom out to the whole earth. On top, we have your navigation display, telephone display, media display, and radio display option. Option and back button, cigarette ashtray. Now let's take a closer look at the middle armrest compartment. Inside we have your auxiliary input along with the USB input. Next to it is the 12 volt core charger. We also have your trunk lock switch here. If you move this over to the lock, you will not be able to open the trunk from the inside. Glove box compartment. More wood trim on the dash here. And here's a complete view of the dash. 
we have your auto dimming rear view mirror along with the universal garage door opener built in. You can simply input your garage door codes in there and use those three buttons to control your garage doors. Light control on top. We have your SOS for roadside assistant. Press that and you'll be automatically transferred to roadside assistant. And lastly, in the middle, we have your power sunroof control. There's the tilt function. And here it is fully open. And now for a closer look at what we have on the driver's side door. Dark wood trim there looks very nice. Four power window control, window lock button at the bottom, side view mirror control on top. Also have a small button to use to control the folding and unfolding of the side view mirror. Press once to fold and press again to unfold. Side door compartment here. And we have up to two easy memory readjustment for the driver's seat there. BMW door sealed. Brake and gas pedal. Hood release lever. And trunk release button. 10-way power front seat with 4-way lumbar support and driver's seat memory. Front seat is ventilated and again has heated function. Seat belt is very smooth and quiet. Here's a closer view of the back seat. More dark wood trim on the door, power window control, side door compartment. Again, I'm five foot seven, so this gives you a better idea of how much leg space you'll have. I feel very comfortable back here. Quick move the front from sitting in the back. Two additional air vents storage space and another 12 volt core charger here and as you can see the middle is being split up so the middle passenger will have to split their legs back seat storage you can also move the headrest forward and backward Here we have more storage space. And in here I believe we have two additional cup holders. You can also raise the middle passenger headrest. Rear seat belts also very smooth and quiet. Rear seat also have the built-in latch system to safely secure down baby seats. Hand bar on top with a spot for you to hang your clothes there. Light control. Driver assistant package, premium package, and the heated seats total up to be $60,100. Overall, I'm in agreement with BMW that the 2015 i sedan is indeed an exploration of beauty. Here's the key fob to the car. On there, starting on top, we have the unlock button, lock button, trunk release, and the panic button in red. On the back, we also have a manual button which we can press to release the manual key. Now let's go ahead and unlock the car and take a closer look at the interior. Again, the one we look at right here comes with the smart keyless access entry. So all you would have to do is leave the key fob in your pocket or purse, stand next to the door, put your hand behind the handle to unlock, and to lock, simply touch right there. Interior comes in black Dakota leather along with dark wood trim. Looks very nice and luxurious. Here's a quick view of the back seat.
and to start the engine all we have to do is push a foot down the brake and press the start button right here the vehicle is in eco sport or manual mode to further enhance gas mileage, there's also the Eco Start and Stop system. When activated, the Eco Start and Stop system will shut off the engine when it comes to a complete stop such as red lights or other idle situation. And immediately after you lift your foot off the brake, the engine automatically restarts within milliseconds. And of course, this feature can be turned off at any time. Up front, there's the rain sensing power intermittent windshield wiper. Moving down, we have the iconic chrome BMW double kidney grille. Parking assists are built into the front bumper to notify the driver whenever the vehicle gets close to hitting any objects. For enhanced visibility, there's a Xenon adaptive headlight with dynamic auto leveling, Corona headlight rings, and LED accent lights. And lastly, both lower fog lights are also LEDs. Moving over to the side, there's the cornering light, chrome side strip, body color side view mirror with integrated LED turn signal, power adjustable feature including power folding, and auto dimming function. The 535i sedan comes standard with 18 inch light alloy wheels with 245-45 run flat tires. Run flat tires give you the ability <laughs> Presenting one of the most fuel efficient car in its class, the 2015 BMW 535i sedan in Alpine White. While it is a luxury 5 series model, it managed to get up to 31 miles per gallon, which means you get all the extravagancy of a luxury model while getting the 3 series gas mileage. As for performance, the 2015 BMW 535i features 300 horsepower under its hood that enable it to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.5 seconds. The model we're looking at right now comes with both the driver assistant package and the premium package. The driver assistant package includes the rear view camera, park distance control, and head up display. The premium package includes the power tailgate, smart keyless access entry, and the satellite radio with one year subscription. And the only other extra feature that you have to pay with this model here is the heated seats. Everything else I mentioned throughout the video will come as standard feature. As for pricing, the standard base model in the US is $55,350. And the model we have here with the optional drive to travel up to another 100 miles even when the tire is punctured by sharp objects such as nails. Behind the wheels we have 4 wheels ventilated disc brakes with anti-lock braking system, dynamic stability control, start off assistant, brake drying, and brake standby feature. All 4 wheels are equipped with the tire pressure monitoring system. To the back there's the LED brake light behind the rear windshield. Moving down, we have the LED tail lamp with LED brake light and LED turn signal light. LED technology offers much quicker illumination thus giving the driver behind you more time to react. Parking assist and a rear view camera is also built into the rear. Further down, there's the attractive Alpine white rear diffuser that matches the body color and hugs the chrome exhaust tip very nicely. As for the gas tank, just make sure the core is unlocked. To open, simply push in, and to lock, simply push back. As simple as that, and it is recommended by BMW to use premium unleaded gas only. Its maximum gas tank capacity is 18.5 gallon. And here's a complete view of the top. We also have the sunroof. Now to open the hood, that's going to be a lever located right down here. All I have to do is pull this lever out. This will initially open the hood. 
and to open the hood fully there's going to be another lever located right below here all I have to do is pull this lever towards us and raise the hood under the hood the 2015 535i has a 3.0 liter BMW twin power turbo inline six cylinder engine with high precision direct injection the six cylinder engine pushes out 300 horsepower at about 5800 rpm and 300 pound foot of torque at about 1300 rpm. It is a 8 speed Steptronic automatic transmission with sport and manual shift modes and adaptive transmission control. The 535i can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.5 seconds while using the automatic transmission and 5.7 seconds while using the manual transmission. Its top speed is electronically limited to 130 miles per hour. As for fuel economy, the 2015 535i gets 20 miles per gallon in the city. 31 miles per gallon on the highway and when combined it gets 24 miles per gallon. Gas mileage will vary depending on which driving mode